Hey everybody, Common Villagey here. Welcome back to the Long Drive. We are out here by another garage. We've been getting really lucky with these garages here lately. I, I just gotta say. And uh, we didn't really find much for our new vehicle, but we uh, did find the proper radiator for it, which is nice. So I put that sucker on there. And we're still, you know, we still got, you know what, I didn't even think to look for a actual grill for this thing. Hmm. This isn't the proper grill, but for now, I'm going to put this grill on. It's going to look funny, but it will actually do for now. That does look pretty funny, but it actually kind of gives it a kind of a neat look in a way. It's not right, though, but yeah. Anyway, we'll keep it on for now until we find Le Proper Grill. Good morning, missus. I did stay the night. I did get attacked by a rabbit, too. But for the most part, we're doing good. We got about uh, two point something liters of fuel. And that fuel does have some oil in it, so probably maybe a little bit less than two liters of fuel. But we've got enough to keep going down the long road to Mom's house, where we are steadily making our way there. It has been quite a long journey, but we're still going. We're still trucking along, and we will make it to the end and see mom who is I'm sure currently working on snacks working on food probably straightening the house up probably went out and uh, rented my favorite movies let's see what do we got here I like Forrest Gump that's one of my favorites let's see Maybe some classics like Willy Wonka and the Chocolate Factory. Maybe a little bit of a, one of our favorites is Wizard of Oz. So definitely probably watch that one. Uh, what else? Let's see. Who knows? May, may uh, see if we can find Lassie. We used to like to watch that show together a lot. Just a lot of good shows. But like I said, we're on our way. We will make it eventually. Of course, we probably still have a good, I would imagine, 2,000 kilometers left or more before we get there. But we're getting there. We're making our way either way. So anyway, hope everyone's doing all right out there today taking care out there staying safe out here in the south weather has definitely been looking nicer it's uh getting close to the end of september which i think the last week in september is next week uh, yeah i may stop here just in case there is some uh ooh, actual fuel here because uh, we kind of need it All right, very good, very good. All right. So like I said in last episode, there is uh, apparently a diesel variants and gasoline variants of the Volkswagen pickup truck, which I didn't really think was a thing at the time, but apparently it is. Okay, here's some gas right here. We'll go ahead and get this in there and let it flush a little bit of that oil out. There we go. We're down to 10% oil, uh, which is good. Alright. Water. I guess we could check the water, but I'm going to say it's more than likely full. But anyway. What else do we got? We've got an empty oil container. Anything in here besides a bike? mirror? Apparently not. 
and nothing up on here. So anyway, that's uh, it. Yeah, let's go. Oh, yeah, let's close that. And be on our way. Oh, yeah, I ran over that. <laughs> Alrighty, so, where was I? Yeah, back on the road once again. Making our way to Mom's house. We've gone through the deserts, the grasslands, the greenlands, the frosty zone. We've conquered mile after mile of rocks and rabbits and gravy roads. Then we've survived all the twists and turns, all the sleep drives, all the things. And we're still going. We're still going strong. Yeah, this thing is a little bit sensitive on the turning. Kind of like the car, but we'll be alright. As soon as I get me a Plymouth Fury engine, we're going to put it in there just because I can. Alrighty. Oh, we got a ship. Yeah, we'll stop there. A little bit further away than I would like, but since we're starting out in a new car, new truck, I guess you could say, it would be a good idea to go ahead and be uh, on our way to uh, essentially filling our tank up. Yeah, let's just head out that way. Or kind of, kind of hang out by the road while we're heading over there, keeping the road close to us, so we know where we're at. Oh, and it looks like there's a building not too far away on the road too, which is going to be great. In fact, I would, I would uh, dare to say that we may get to the building first, but we'll see. Oh, and it looks like a, just a regular gas station, but yeah, we'll look for parts. But I try to, I'm going to try to preserve all the gas, though, for sure. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, come on. Everything's fine. Everything's fine. Let's just, uh, there we go. There we go. Right. Auto save. Okay, okay. Alright, so, yeah, we'll stop by this gas station real quick and then we'll go to the cargo ship and hopefully get lucky with some uh, gas over there. But we'll uh, stop here real quick. Just in case we find something we need here. Okay, so... Doesn't look like anything that we need here. A nice, shiny, empty coolant tank that goes to Plymouth Fury. Oh, we do got a sponge. Which we'll take. Because, uh... We'll make the are all shiny with it. Okay, one more. There we go. Oh, it's going to be white, huh? Oh, well, not bad, not bad, not bad. But, uh, I do like a little bit of color. Red. Oh, here's some gas, but we're going to go to the ship, so I'm not worried about the gas. Uh, How about like a, maybe a, maybe. Maybe a nice silver color? Still pretty white. We'll go with 10%. Yeah, 
Yeah, not exactly silver, but uh, why not? We'll try 15. Yeah, not bad, not bad. Okay, kind of a grayish color, but whatever. Okay, dokie. Well, let's, uh, yeah, let's get out of here. Actually, I want to get the basket that's in here. And I may, uh, keep that, uh, dark paint in case I may need it down the road. Okay. Yeah, we'll grab you and, uh, put you in here. Right. Okay. Anything else I wanted to grab? Uh. Yeah. Well, since I'm going to be grabbing a Plymouth Fury engine later on, I guess I'll go ahead and uh, grab this thing. Since, uh. I can. It isn't necessary. But if we're going to get the Plymouth Fury engine eventually anyway, might as well have the proper radiator for it, which holds a ton of water. Okay. Who needs to go the proper route anyway? Hello, rabbit, wherever you are. I don't care where you are, but... I know where I'm going. I'm going towards the cargo ship to get some fuel. Yes, indeed. And then we'll be back on our merry way towards bigger and better things in the long drive. Alright, ship, you better have some fuel for me. That's all I got to say. Okay. We like our cargo ships. We really do. They really are fun. Okay. Yeah, there we go. There we go. Okay. Just hop right out, and there's your ship. Gonna do like one of my favorite YouTubers does and puts a barrel up like that. That way you know kind of where you got started from. And look at that, already we got lucky enough to get some gas. This will probably be enough, but we'll see if we can find more to fill up the tank completely. Ready? No? Let's open that up. No, 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 not that. Come on, give me the thing. Let's uh, like do it like that then. Oh, all right, flush that oil out of there, <clears throat> and we'll see if we can find, get lucky and find another barrel. This is gonna take a little bit, but we'll be all right. All right, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Alrighty. 23 gallons, I think. Something like that. 99% gas. Good, good, good. And you can go bye-bye. Well, that didn't roll away like I thought it was going to, but that's fine. Alright, there's uh, that. Let's just look out here this way first, I guess. Uh, alcohol... And empty. What else? Oh, what, what? Diesel. And, oh wait. Empty. I hate searching through all this grass. Diesel again. Oil. Alcohol. Auto save. Okay, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Okay, here's a barrel. Oil, right. And alcohol. 
Oil, alcohol, diesel. Right. Um, definitely got some weight to you. Wait, did I just... Oh, there we go. There's our gas. So we'll have a full tank of gas now. Very good. All right. It's getting dark. We'll, uh... Let's see. Can't tell if the lights are on yet or not. Let's see. Yeah, they are. Let's grab our thing and have a nap real quick. Very good. Very well. All is well. We have got enough gas now to fill this thing up, flush all the oil out, and be on our merry way to new and better things. Come on, give me 100%. Oh well, 99%. Can't complain. Okay, good morning, missus. We are ready to go. Full tank of gas. We've got our rubber wife and our road lotion. Can't complain at all. We've essentially got it made. So anyway, yeah, I, I like that grill. I, I, just, I don't know. I just like it. Now you can use the uh, uh, rock to kill yourself. I'm so sorry. Forgive me. Right. Let's try not to kill ourselves again. Oh, I guess I wasn't keeping my eyes on the grass enough. Man, I hate that. Okay, so we're here. Wait. I'm going to guess that we didn't fill the tank up all the way, did we? No, not yet. Alright, let's, uh... I'm going to see if that... <laughs> if that barrel is still out here, but I have no idea if it still is or not. There's diesel. But it was pretty far back here. Oh man, that sucks. All right. Oh. Empty. I have no idea. Man, I hate that. I should have. I guess I'm gonna have to start dropping a hard save or whatever you want to call that before. Yeah, there it is again. Alright, I'll fill up. Actually, let's uh, let's go ahead and sleep real quick while we're under here. And hopefully auto save will kick in. If not, I'll try to remember to drop a save. But I'm just going to, we've already seen this before. So I'm just going to pause, fill the tank up, and I will meet you back here in a sec. Okay. Real quick, like, I'm just going to save. Okay. And there we go. Good morning once again. And let's try to do this the right way this time and not kill ourselves. 
Alrighty. So, yeah. On our way back to the road, to the long drive. And just to be safe, I'm going to not go so fast until I get back on the road again. I'm pretty sure the road's out here. Here it is. Oh, yeah. Like I said, I do like that grill. I may keep it. It doesn't have to be a proper build where everything's the way it's supposed to be. It's more fun this way. Alright, so back at it again. Just going to uh, check something. Very good. But we've got a uh, we've got a uh, full tank of gas now, which isn't saying much. Usually the ships, well, actually the ships here lately have been giving us gas, but there have been some cases where there have been ships that didn't have any gas at all, but normally they do. In most cases they do, I would say. Ah, oh, yes. Whoa. Yeah, this uh, little uh, pickup truck really goes fast. It's a really fast engine. Trying to get a good look at this building over here. Oh. Well, those type of buildings, huh? Well, I definitely want to look, that's for sure. Whoa. Hold on. Oh, ooh, a big truck. Really? Really? A big truck, and of course there's probably no diesel. But uh, what would we expect? Something to go our way? Got some pretty good tires on it, actually. Alcohol. <laughs> it's full of alcohol. It's got an empty fuel tank, but it's got a ton of alcohol. Oh. Hmm. Man, I almost want to drive it, though. Oh, headlight. Only thing about it, though, is that one, we don't got any diesel, and not entirely sure. I mean, really, all you need is oil and diesel. But yeah, we'll just leave her here. Yeah, let's get going. Actually, real quick, I want to see if I can find a sponge or maybe some cleaner. Either one will do just fine. Oh, hey. Green ones? Huh. Why not? And a hat. I guess I have a hat still. Well, let me put that on for sure. Diesel. <laughs> There's 0.3 liters of diesel that would maybe get us off the parking lot. That's about it, though. That's revolver ammo. Uh, no sponge, though. Kind of a drag. Kind of a drag. A broken bottle and some oil. Wouldn't hurt to check up on the oil. I get this feeling like I'm playing Imperion now with the night vision goggles on. <laughs> Alright. Very good. Thank you. Yeah, I'll keep these glasses on for now. Can't see myself in the rearview mirror, but that's okay. 
Oh yeah, we can. Let's see here. Let me uh look up. Ah <laughs> yes. Very well, very well. Yes, indeed. All right. Oh no. <laughs> Forgot to look for any water in here, but we'll be alright. Okay, so anyway, we shall get back on the road. Alrighty, anyway, we'll see what happens here in the, the long drive now. Well, just one car at that gas station, but you can't win them all. It's a good thing I got these white wall tires on, or that rock probably could have done us in. Ooh, is that a garage? I think it is. Man, we have gotten lucky with the garages here lately. I mean, seriously. Really lucky. And it's right here. Okay. Let's just kind of pull her on around here. Like that. Hmm. How do I look? Huh? You like the green? Yeah, they're alright. Alrighty. Another green day, I guess. Oh, hello, autosave. How are you? Alrighty, so... Oh. Hold that thought. Hello. Hey. Ah, oh, dang it. He got me. He got me. Am I shooting my gun? You stupid rabbit. Right after it auto-saved. Well, at least it auto-saved. Okay. Let's try this again. It, like, jumped on me. Stupid thing. I feel really incompetent now. <laughs> All right, uh, where are you? I know I heard a rabbit. Okay, maybe not this time. Okay, that's fine. All right, three, two, one. And it's another truck. Whoa, a bus engine. <laughs> Oh, interesting. Uh, hmm. Oh, really nothing here, is there? Nah, not really. Another truck, interesting. Okay, well. Oh, wait, ammo. Well, we're we're okay. We got 28 rounds. That's almost a full clip. All right. It's kind of an uneventful garage, I guess you could say. But that's going to happen for sure. All right. Let's keep going. Mom's house we go. And whatever car will take us there. Or truck. Now if that bus engine was a actual gasoline engine, I'd be halfway tempted to take it, but it's not. It is, of course, a diesel engine. Car? No car. Oh well. You can't always get what you want. We know that. It would be fun if you got everything you wanted all the time. 
you'd have no need to wait no reason to persevere no light at the end of the tunnel I guess you could say got another ship way over there and what's uh, if I can get a good peek in what is that way over there that is another ship already cruising along at a good rate oh yeah this is a nice little truck I really like it mm, it's gonna be crazy when I get the big engine in there okay easy You know, I was, I was uh, doing some uh, audio testing. I've been having kind of trouble with my audio, like my mic audio. And, oh, I killed myself again. Dang it. I tell you, this is what happens. I get to talking and then, bang. Oh, man, come on. Oh, that's painful. Okay, okay. That's really painful. <sighs> Dang it. And we're back here. Well... I guess we didn't make it all that far down the road, I guess. But anyway, like I was saying, I was, I was testing out my mic audio, and I was, like, doing some recordings of the long drive, actually. And one thing I noticed was uh, that the starter place that you start at, I used to think it was always in the desert, but sometimes you can actually start, I guess in the Greenlands because I it's actually started in the Greenlands and it yeah I was surprised anyway let's uh, not go into an extensive conversation while we're driving even though I was just talking about testing my mic audio out but I don't know if it's exactly what it is but I don't know if it's the, the front ports on my PC whether I need to get a new headset or what, but I was having a lot of trouble with my microphone sounding like like it was fading out, like sort of muffled in a way. And I looked up stuff, and I but I never really could find a solution, so I ended up plugging in my headset into the back of my computer, and that seems to work for the most part. It's not perfect, but I my voice is at least more audible than it was. Uh, one of the YouTubers I watch, he actually recommended uh, he uses a uh, clip-on mic, and I've been thinking about getting one of those just to see how the uh, audio sounds and everything, you know, just to see what it really might be. And of course, I really don't know, but. I would definitely be willing to test it out just in case. So anyway, yeah. It sucks when things start to break down, but that's all part of it, let me tell you. I've been doing YouTube videos since 2018 and I've definitely had my fair share of problems throughout that time whether it was internet or some kind of personal problem like I've you know there's been setbacks I had to move at one point and just all kinds of stuff can happen like wrecking your truck oh come on come on come on we can do this Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. 
Okay, fine. Be that way. Alrighty. Of course, we get our car stuck on a rock. There we go. Whoa there, horsey. No, you're not running away from me. Get over here. Alright, anyway, well, we got an auto save in, which is good. Just in case we have any more freak accidents. Which I hope we don't. But once I get to talking, things start to get dangerous. But people actually do like my commentary, so I'm going to keep doing it. Actually, a lot of people do. And I do appreciate it. Actually, while recording this, today I've hit uh, 170 subscribers, so thank you all so much. I mean, it really, I can't tell you how encouraging it is to see my subscriber count that high. It's just been really, really fun. And I, like I've said before, I really would like to get that community tab open. It would be a really cool thing for my channel. But, you know, one thing at a time. But I do appreciate your support. I really do. I've had a lot of people support me on my channel this year. Uh, my friend uh, I work with every day named Chris, he has uh, helped me a lot with subscribers. Grump Grumpy Scamp has helped me with subscribers. And just... Uh, probably a lot of other people too just sharing and all that kind of stuff helping my youtube channel grow just thank you guys so much you guys have been so awesome in helping me out oh also i and i didn't even think about this also uh uh lettuce plays actually featured me on one of his videos and his subscriber count is uh much bigger than mine <laughs> But he actually featured me on one of his videos, which I was, uh, I, I thought it was really cool. And I, uh, let us play, if you're watching this, I do appreciate you featuring me on your, one of your videos. It was, it's been really cool to see, uh, my video in someone else's video. It was pretty cool. So I do appreciate that. So anyway, kind of got a little emotional there, but yeah, sometimes that happens. You know, you got to give credit where credit's due. And I have really have had a lot of support this year. So, thank you guys so much. I do appreciate it. And I and I hope you'll continue to, to uh, be with me in this uh, long YouTube journey. Come on, land it, land it, land it, land it. Good. Okay, hey, we did it. We did it. Yes. Yes. Really, I couldn't have done it without you guys. So I do appreciate every subscriber, everybody that that's uh, helped me. All the comments, all the likes, and all that stuff. Thank you all. I really do appreciate it. Okay, awesome. So, let's see, what are we looking at here? Right. Oh, uh, got a bunker, huh? I guess we'll look at it. Kind of approach the bunker from the back. There we go. Very good. Oh, wait. What's going on here? I can't. Oh, this glitch again. Uh, I hate this glitch. Nope. Nope, nope, nope. No? No. I can't see... All right, my car is not. All right. Uh, I don't know what that glitch is, but I've never had that happen before. Okay, let's reload that. I don't know what was going on. Man, that was stupid. I had all kinds of stuff happen in this episode, man. It's crazy. Oh, the loading takes forever. All right. 
anyway. Yeah. Okay, shut her off. Uh, let's sleep real quick. Okay. I'll turn down my head volume a little bit. All right. Maybe a little bit more. Okay, probably our last stop for the day, and of course, since I had to reload, some stuff got spat out of the building. Got a little bit of gas, a little bit of oil. Oh, no way, do we, do we actually got, yep. We've got our first door for this thing. Absolutely. Absolutely. Now what's this? This is not... No. That's your bunt, uh Trunk lid. We don't need any of that. Ah, uh, don't really have to have a basket right now. Yeah, everything just got <laughs> moved over. Everything. Uh, let's try to fill up that uh, radiator while we're here. Might as well. Oh, yeah. Right, yeah. Let's, uh, try to do this best we can may have to hold it or something so I don't think it's just oh it might it might there we go there we go very good very good We'll get this thing filled up and everything and have it ready for next episode. Oh, yeah. Okay. Almost there. Right. There we go. We'll shut that. It's full of water now, which is good full radiator which is always good okay all right so uh anyway just gonna just gonna drop these just for now actually I've had my fun with them but it's just a little bit too much green <laughs> alrighty so Anyway, next uh, episode, did we have to find any polish, did we? No, I don't think we did. So, we have come to the end of another episode of The Long Drive. We're doing really good in this little pickup truck, which I kind of like. It's kind of neat. And I really like this grill. It really makes it stand out. It, it pro there probably are bumpers for this, but I think for the pickup truck it looks better without the bumpers. Yeah, that's just my opinion though. So anyway, y'all, thank you so much for watching. I do appreciate all your support and, and watching my videos. So I hope you take care out there. Have a good one. And I will see you all hopefully next time.